On Sunday, the 6th of April 2014, the Polish ambassador to New Zealand, Beata Stoczynska, unveiled a plaque at Baycourt Arts and Community Center in Tauranga. It is dedicated to Polish composer Frédéric Chopin. The plaque is one of a number of plaques unveiled throughout New Zealand and is part of the Polish Embassy's project Polish Trails in New Zealand. It's a special occasion. This is a cooperation between Tauranga Motor Control Council and the Polish Embassy to install plaques commemorating 40 years of co diplomatic relationship between Poland and New Zealand. Dzień dobry Państwu. Bardzo się cieszę z tego spotkania dzisiaj i z możliwości takiej jakby tutaj promocji Polski w Tauranga. It is my pleasure and honor to welcome you all on the occasion of the celebration of a Polish great composer, Friedrich Chopin. You can ask why we celebrate Chopin here in New Zealand, in Tauranga. The great Polish poet, Cypriam Kamil Norwid, said about Friedrich Chopin, born as Varsovian, a Pole at heart, but in his talent, a citizen of the world. So we are in the world, we are in New Zealand, so we can celebrate Chopin here. Friedrich Chopin is one of the most important Polish artists, musician and composer of the Romantic era. Creative, ambitious, innovative, his idea to mix Polish folk music with classical piano melody have huge impact to Polish heritage. For years, people have been impressed by his mazurkas and polonaises, which he started to compose in his early ages. In 1830, as a 20-years-old man, he left Poland forever. Although he moved abroad, he still remembered his Polish roots. He became an active part of the Polish society and community in Paris those times, and was friend of other Polish great artists which were living on exile, like Mickiewicz or Norwood. Living in a different countries and cultures had also influenced at his music. Heinrich Heim said, Poland has given him a ninth sense and its historical suffering. France, lightness, elegance and charm. Germany, romantic death. Today, New Zealand is a country which takes its heritage from many different nations. I'm very glad that the plan dedicated to Frédéric Chopin has found its home in Tauranga, in this beautiful Bay Court Art Center. I want to thank Eva, Magda, Margaret for your help and support to organize this event. It is my great pleasure to, to unveil the plaque. So now I, I think I should go to the plaque, yes, and, and unveil the plaque. <laughs> thank you very much. So this is beautiful Polish plaque, and on the plaque we have and absolutely nice small plaque dedicated to Frederick Chopin. And actually, the plaque dedicated to John Paul II will be unveiled in the cathedral in Wellington, 27 of April, the day of canonization of John Paul II. Thank you, everybody, especially Eva. For, for organizing and I'm very happy that Frederick Chopin is here. So thank you again. <laughs>